Dayton's FHL hockey team. The Dayton Demons celebrating. They just won the league's championship. That means they're in possession of the Commissioner's Cup. Demon, or Demons captain Brian Marks live this morning, as is defenseman Joe Pace and forward Jared Hicks. Good morning, guys. Good morning. There you are, and there's the cup. How good does that look? Oh, looks great. <laughs> <laughs> uh, go real quickly, say where you're from and how long you've been on the team. Go uh, ahead, Brian. I'm Brian Marks uh, from Brownville, New York, and this is my second year with the Demons. Uh, Joe Pace from Chicago, <laughs> Illinois, and uh, yeah, it's funny, I've only been here about a month. Yeah, and your story, you were on a competing team and then they picked you up. Yep, I've been playing against these guys for the past two years. <laughs> that is hilarious. Well, um, you joined at the right time, obviously. Jared? Yep. And I'm Jared Hicks, and I'm from Quispamsis, New Brunswick, in Canada. That Canadian, there you go. <laughs> and and how, many, how many guys are Canadian on the team? Is it a good mix? Uh, yeah. yeah, it's probably, probably 10 or 12. Half. Half? There yeah. you go. And what was the difference this season? You guys uh, made it to the finals last Last year, this season you pulled it out. What was the difference? Uh, I was here last year and it was a tough feeling, but uh, we just played better. Last year uh, we struggled a bit. We couldn't score goals, and this year we had no problem. So there, no problem. Yeah. That, that sounds awesome. And, and Joe, talk about the team. You obviously joined it at the perfect time as they were on the quest for that for the cup. But you played against these guys. Um, what was it like to come over to Dayton to play? Oh, it was a great feeling. But you know. Playing against these guys for the last two years, especially Brian, you know, they battle so hard and, you know, it's fun playing against them and now it's even more fun playing with them. And Jared, for the folks at home watching that, you know, aren't too familiar with how the hockey leagues work, mm -hmm. talk about the league that you guys play in and how it fits in with maybe the NHL or the Cincinnati Cyclones, what people might be more familiar with. Yeah, it's definitely a little further than a, a stone throw away from the NHL, that's for sure. <laughs> it's, it's a couple leagues down, but uh, you got the Cincinnati Cyclones just in Cincy obviously and it's uh, the East Coast Hockey League and we're just right below them so it's kind of we filter in and out through the East Coast League. And, and when you guys obviously come together here in Dayton what's it like at Harrow Arena what would you like to say to the fans who maybe haven't been out to a game yet to come next year to cheer cheer you guys on? Oh well I mean it's been great our fans are awesome they like saw video clips of us when we were in Danbury the Harrow Pub was just rocking for us so we have great support and everybody that I know that's comes to their first game is, ends up being a season ticket holder. That's awesome. That, is that a sh uh, beer shower? What is that? Uh, champagne. Champagne. Really champagne. Really there you go. <laughs> well, and hockey and beer kind of go together. Yeah. So that was that was my <laughs> guess. And, and Joe, as you reflect on kind of on, on where you guys have been in terms of getting the cup here, goals for next season. Uh, you know, I think the biggest thing for every organization is just to repeat. Uh -huh. You know, try to do it again. And when you guys look at this, the, the league's only, there's only three names on here, so the league is really only three years old, but you said there's kind of a history behind it, too. The, the league had been disbanded for a bit. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, it uh, kind of has a little history with the movie uh, Slapshot that starred uh, Paul Newman and the Hanson brothers. <laughs> you know, their team was uh, the Charlestown Chiefs of the Federal Hockey League. So, you know, we picked up the same kind of logo and the same name and, you know, kind of the same cities out on the East Coast, so it's fun. And, and Jared, you said this trophy hasn't really been out of your grasp and since you guys have won it. Where's it, where's it been? Uh, it's, it's pretty much been everywhere. Uh, we, had her, we had her downtown just, and uh, Mark's the captain, obviously. I think he slept with it the first couple of nights. It's, <laughs> it's been hard to get out of his hands. But uh, yeah. anywhere, uh, anywhere anyone wants it, we're willing to take pictures. It's and saw the patio at El Toro the other day. <laughs> and you said you even took it to the outlet mall in Monroe. Yep. Yeah, anywhere we, we go. Shopping. If you got a beer to pour in it, we're going to drink it. So. I, I like that. And if you want to go have a beer and celebrate with the Dayton Demons tonight, they're going to hoist the cup. It's a big fan celebration, so head on out to the Hair Arena. It starts at 7.30. And say congratulations to these guys, too. They definitely earned it. We have more information on that event tonight and, of course, on the Dayton Demons if you log on to fox45now.com. Click on Fox 45 in the morning. Congrats and thanks for coming in. Thank, well, thank you. Thank you.